How then can we restore our first love? The church in Ephesus was commended for her good deeds and persevering faith in the midst of hardship. They thought they were doing well until Christ pointed out to them the reality of their hearts. Yet I have this against you. You have forsaken your first love. Revelation chapter 2, verse 4. The Greek word for first means first in priority. We have lost our first love when Christ is no longer the first in priority in our lives. There are many competing distractions that may dislodge Christ to secondary priority. The pursuit of career opportunities that consume too much of our energies, key relationships in our lives that we cannot seem to surrender to the Lord, or our overcommitments in Christian service that leaves us worn out. We think we are doing well, but actually we are slip sliding away. How then can we restore our first love? Firstly, we must come before God to repent from allowing seemingly good things to become substitutes for our first love. We need to re-evaluate the priorities in our lives so that our love for God is unrivaled. Secondly, recall those moments when we first encountered Christ and celebrate again our salvation story. Rekindle the excitement of being a child of God and the youthful abandonment in serving Christ when we were younger. As we mature in Christ and perhaps attain material security, it takes even more effort to maintain our first love for Christ. But Christ deserves and demands supremacy in all areas of our lives. If Christ is not Lord of all, He is not Lord at all.